it, especially yep. those off-stage high recoveries that that Dill wasn't punishing. Yeah. Let's see if it happens again. I think it's just stylistically. These are oh. two very, very different players. I love the switch to actually go for the Fox here. Being able to go a little bit further with up B is going to give you that little extra room of cushion. Um, so, I, honestly, I, I quite enjoy this pick. Yeah, and this is a run back to the original name of Tilde Fox. Also, Tilde being one of the biggest rising like stars of post-pandemic, really just coming out and just tearing yeah. things up. This Fox has always been very good, too, so let's see if it works out. He's always been like a consistent top 8 like at least top 24 right? But never has he been doing like this well this consistently. So you know what? I'm actually really happy for him because I think he's one of the six players to be doing it right now. What a catch on the landing. But never forget that Rob's got a bit of meat on those um on those gears and still gonna be able to live a little bit longer. I was gonna I was gonna ask you like where the bones at? Like where, like is is there is there like is there like a smaller person inside Rob controlling Rob? Is that what you're trying to say? Yeah. Is it Ness inside Rob? Because they both are mashers? Is that what you're trying to say? I feel like you don't like Ness, man. I don't, I don't know what it is, but I, I, I feel like you're not actually a fan of that. I um, never said I wasn't a fan. I'm just calling, oh I'm just saying what you said. Oh, my oh. God, the aggressive backer of stage. That's not something you ever expect out of Fox And you, you know do. who would live that? Fox? You know who wouldn't live that if they didn't have the double jump? Falco. So that was just beautifully played. Oh, no. Zombo going to be missing a really, really critical... Um, attempt to edge guard there, but still catches the jump out of the corner. Out of the corner, you know what people do? They either go in or they either jump at any level of play. So. That was a good check to Tilde, too, because Tilde in that position wants to get a jump in dare or, a, or a nair, start the combo up. up. And That's Tilde Fox. got cooked, quite literally. That is, like you said, just Fox. That's Fox, baby. When it, once you got being like that and your opponent's got a big old spike, you, you gotta start counting all of your lucky stars. Hashtag Fox sucks. <laughs> yes. Yep. I mean, Fox can't kill or jab block. Just missed that jab. But honestly, like, I still I still feel pretty good for Tilde's position. Never mind. Never mind. Oh, no double jump Never off mind. stage. Zamba's in a position to cover every single option. Oh, that Jago actually going to be clanking with the Fiery Fox hitbox. Um, but, wow. Tilde's advantage. Catch on the jump. Oh, no. it, it oh, no. forced the air dodge, but was out of position to get the follow-up up there. So you just kind of walk around. Literally walked around menacingly and got the up smash. Unfortunately, it is Town and it is Rops who's able to live just uh, to be able to live that. Well, I like how Zamba just playing back a little bit now. Oh, Tilde just trying to get so ambiguous, so tricky. Goes for the stage control there instead of the belly, which I really respect it. Look at those angles. Oh, that was an incredible angle. And for, oh, and another <laughs> high recovery angle, too. All right. It's trying to stutter step, catches him with the forward smash. Yeah. I mean, look, we've seen a lot of disrespectful lead up to forward smash. That's in the chat for those who watched those uh, Monday. Those high recovery side be so dangerous. Is this going to be the stock? No, not quite. <gasps> I do believe Tilde was able to footstool, oh. jump out of there. Oh. Look at these follow-ups. Oh. Mamma Mia. Ma fo avoids the grab, gets the follow-up, <gasps> gets on the platform. Jab, uh, jab tries to pull, call him out afterwards, but does not get a follow-up afterwards. But 61%, and Tilde oh. is oh. looking good here, Dara. Yeah, but uh, unfortunately, Tilde well, doesn't have mind. any quick plays to take the stock. <laughs> One blue <laughs> side B. What? Wait. Why did he keep doing it? What? Like, I know the Sakurai combo exists. You try to read a roll or something there, right? But like, what? 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 But Rob's not a kill percent. What happened here? You what just got punched here? on shield. Why would Why would Zamba be scared in that spot to possibly have to? Like, you take a grab. You're not dead. You're just taking damage. Yeah. I don't know. I just. Stop side being directly in the shield. That's all I'm saying. Stop so, side being directly into shield. Also, just don't get spiked. <laughs> just don't get hit. Just don't get hit. That's, don't get hit. That's what I've been saying since day one. Yeah. I do like, actually, a lot of the times that Tilde chose to play a little bit back and throughout lasers. You know why? That is non-committal free damage. Yep. What are you, you going to do? You're going to run into more of them? No. You're going to be taking some of those hits eventually. Tilde understood, hey, from this position, maybe it's not worth it for me to keep on pressure. Mm -hmm. I really, really liked a lot of his laser implementation this game. Yeah, it's all about setting it up properly because if anybody knows the timing of Fox, they can't get in and burst on yeah. that. But we have Kalos now. This is... I, I, I like this idea because you have different... Uh, now you can adjust your timing on recovery with the wall jumps from Falco. Yep. Uh, but Tilde just going to be looking for that one in, and this is going to be it. Gets that drag down and still able to cover Zamba, mashing out of disadvantage. 72% onto the board because you lost neutral once. GG's.
I mean, we could already see Tilde's got, uh, Tilde's got like some callow specific combos. That was just barely ripped off the side of the, the platform there with that follow-up, keeping this pressure game up. And also you get to mix up the timing of when oh, you no. go for a down air or not and catch it with the back air, but Kalos and some good DI that's gonna keep Rob alive for a long time. Up field and is so smart that Zamba's not gonna have that as an immediate get off me option. And Zamba was forced into a pull recovery option until they found that back here to be able to do it, but now stuck in a nasty position. Beautiful DI though, still gonna be holding on to that stock a little bit longer. You know, easily the thing that confuses me the most about when people fight the Rob matchup is why don't they throw, if you don't have oh, good oh. gyro setups, oh. throw the gyro up. Also, oh. if you got good combo setups, if you're Till day, keeping this damage going. <gasps> Those lasers as an erupt. That beautiful angle to be able to oh, stall. Oh. Till day. Oh, I thought till day, I think that down tilt was definitely meant to be a drop down down air. But till day, uh, respecting the down tilts, not trying oh, to no. get caught. No double jump off stage, and now has to recover from a nasty position. But Gob, oh my not going to be able to cover it in time. Till they can still make this one back. That was such a smart up B angle too, and then using the wall jump up oh B to mix up the God. timing. And then you see Zamba just not even saying, "All right, all right, yeah, you're right. I got caught. I overextended. Up smash is going to finally put a win on deck for Zamba." But. With a two-stock lead, this is where Tilde gets really aggressive. Oh, Tilde just crossing up shield once again, recognizing that Zamba's up smash there might have been unsafe on hit. Would not have been a reliable out-of-shield option. So much pressure rolls in. A little bit of spaghetti. Oh, oh, oh. Mom's upset. Like, it just keep it up. Like, it, there's no reason to not try to box like this right now because you have a borrowed stock. All okay. this trade is in favor of you. Okay. Tilde, the air dodges though, trying to avoid that up air, got called hard, and the frame traps continue. <laughs> yeah, you, yeah, you, you, you nod your head after that one. There, there's really, there's, you can't get mad no matter what. You got mixed hard. It happens. Tilde able to actually put a point on the board. We did not see this from him in winner's yeah. side in that set. He was getting consistently mixed, had a hard time recovering, yeah. but this one looked way better here. When you can find those kinds of edge guards on a kick, dude, like Rob, that's... That's just so huge. And just think again about this. The way that Tilde pressures off stage, as soon as he also encourages you to go for a lot of high recoveries, right? He's gonna be up there swinging with up air. You're genuinely not safe. It's just straight up not happening. Oh my. Yeah, now we're running it back here to Town and City. Incredible saves for both. You got plenty of combos for platforms. You got the early kills off the side for forward air and side B and such oh from my. Rob. There you go. Oh, this platform is... and center. And you get and you're for, you're pretty much forced to hold shield there because if you don't, you get hit by a follow-up up till anyways. This is this is just Falco on Town and City. You have oh to hold God. a lot of this. Tilde trying to maybe catch a tech in place is not gonna be able to do so quite yet. And that down beat, so disjointed, it's just like a slap in, in your face. Yeah, it just completely checks all of you know that that gyro checks any aggressive approach from Tilde. Uh, excuse me, oh my. Zamba. Oh my god, gets caught again. Forner won't kill yet. This shield pressure is honestly just top notch from Tilde. But as soon as he's put into disadvantage just once, Zamba, uncharacteristically missing the tech chase, sets up that frame trap. What do you do? You suffer. You get hit. Tilde is ready to cover every single option in the book. Much like Dr. Doom, this game is over. And right now, Tom, Zamba, I, 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 I'm, sent, I'm looking at like almost like a sense of pause in zombies like okay i have mm. to chill i have to slow down i am going in too much and that's what's causing me to get cooked you have six whole minutes on the clock you need to be able to play with that time but right now nothing is getting played with in your life man 65 percent and still going you know gob's disadvantage can be a little bit difficult to deal with especially when falco is constantly up in your face able to get so many different resets look at all those drag downs from from tilde i do believe that was intended to be a back end, but either way that just can be big damage you see the way that gyro yep. bounced off that recover that reflector looked disgusting but that up smash also incredibly strong. Now, however, though, it you is completely irrelevant. <laughs> that confirmed from Tilde just so tight. The timing on that was beautiful. <gasps> Tries to get that track. He had the great idea, but just a little bit too slow. Falco, not all that quick on his feet. Oh my goodness, and this is looking exactly the same as what we saw last game. You have a whole stock up, so what's Tilde gonna do? Press way more buttons in your face, because these are perfectly fine trades for Tilde. I feel like Tilde's boxing this game has just been so much tighter than Zamba's, and he's been able to get a lot more out of it. Zamba has not gone through like a lot of grabs at low presents, and was just not able to catch him sitting in shield a lot. I think, a like, I think most of because Tilde's just been playing counter grab. He's going for a lot of short hop dares. He's going for a lot of short hop like forwarders. He's basically staying away wow. from any possible grabs that Zamba can put on, and now Zamba's pretty much looking at what is probably going to be a reset. He's, he's, his spacing this game is just so effective, and this is the danger. Do you want to be landing against Falco? No. No. <laughs> oh my god. Zamba literally hit like
like three back airs and an air to still die. Like, if there's ever been a moment of you're trying to teach somebody to just stop pressing buttons at disadvantage, that's it. Like, look at this one, he was a chilling. two, a three, a goodbye. He was like, you pressing buttons. Totally didn't do anything. He just waited. One, a two, a, a three. little bit closer. Bang! <laughs> How many looks does it take to get to the center of this mix-up? And hence, look at that pose. Like, oh, that's some protagonist pose right there. So we got a reset. Yeah, Dara, we saw how good Tilde, uh, excuse me, Zamba was earlier. Do you see any possible comebacks from Zamba right now? Can he make the adjustments? Because right now he's just getting mixed. Yeah, I think some of his just like close quotings options are a little bit questionable. He's not going for grabs into a lot of the right scrambles, I feel like, and Tilde's just getting a lot uh, away a lot just sitting in shield um as well. So if you're not if you're like like not getting those grabs on Falco, you can definitely just be missing out on a lot of opportunity. Yeah, and just getting wins at disadvantage as well. And oh my god, just rolling regularly in front of him, getting red. You see he shook his head on that one. He's just now, waiting. Yeah, the mental aspect is starting to get into the game here. When you see visibly that uh, Zamba is starting to actually show his frustration, that is bad because then you just start swinging in way more spots you shouldn't be. Uh, and again, I feel like just Tilde is getting a getting away with just like a lot of on-shield options. I want to see some more dash back punishes from Zamba. I want to see some more parry attempts too. Um, because th those could just be so key. Oh my. Oh, uh, luckily T Town and City came in clutch for a second there, but another one of those probably ain't gonna do it. He's so oh, ooh. Little bit aggressive from Tilde, pulling the trigger on that back air. Now Zamba has a lead, probably a very short oh one Oh my. Tilde tracking you all the way up there is so scary. That up smash was still able to kill Zamba's the eye with Pog Champ, and you know what? Still not enough at the end of the day. And just like that, from one down throw, Tilde's gonna be able to get so much. That gyro hit completely disregarded. He's chefing. He is chefing. I am a big fan of how, like, like I got hit, I don't even give a damn. Like, just kept it going. Yep. Now, even game though, Zamba luckily out of position to get punished for that side B, but it does look like Zamba at least is starting to keep himself actually in the match. Oh, tries to go in so aggressively, but Zamba was in no position to be able to cover that in time. Down B, so good at catching dashes, so good at catching your next projectile, but you know what it's not good for catching? Agav just jumping in so aggressively with back here. Tilde was just, he felt so trapped. Yeah, it covers so many options. Spot dodge, jump in, like pretty much a dash attack maybe early he's, might have helped, but... He's looking for it. His eyes are just like on the blast zone. I was gonna laugh so hard if he got hit by the same thing again. It's like press all these options in the air, still get, and then right there, the aggressive nair. He's at zero, he's gonna trade with you there every time. Or 8%, but still. Yeah. Gets that tech chase, finds that falling down. Oh, look at this KitchenAid, oh mixing. Oh my goodness. Chef is happy, and boy, what are these options? Trying to go for this aggressive option on landing. Gets grabbed, though. He's keeping it up. But Zamba only commits to the side platform. Tilde is going to be able to cross him up successfully. And now, just catching Zamba on all of these whiff buttons, he's waiting for that one poorly spaced back here so that he can get in there with his dominating double jump. This match is so crucial to the tempo of the rest of the set because <gasps> if Zamba could get control of a lead, he at least can play with some comfort that he could be a little bit more aggressive. But if you roll in like that, you're going to get body my uh, friend it does not matter the di you got you're gonna have to hold that and tilde has been cruising he's so good. looking so good right now yeah he's those follow-ups those tracks on zamba's next option those are so tough T tilde he is not now it's it's difficult to catch rob landing mm -hmm. his hitbox big you know what they're also active but his spacing and his timing on everything that he's been doing. Landing catches, catching Rob pressing neutrally, the back in skies. He's making it so difficult for Zamba to play his landing um, game. I must say, I must say, if, if you have, you know, if you're down in bracket and you're looking for possibly a comeback, this is definitely one of the ways Funny. to do it. But Smashville for Falco, after how you've been getting cooked on the other ones, must say, not necessarily the smartest idea. I definitely disagree with the stage choice. Look what happens when you give uh, Tilde a little bit of stage. But that time, Obuk sending just once with Saibi. I feel like that's how he's been giving most of his openings away. Just really, really unsafe commitments like that. Oh, no double jump. This should be the stock. Yes, it is. There you go. Covered it beautifully. I think pretty much what Zamba's trying to say right now is like, my fundies are going to be better than yours, and I'm going to beat you on your stage. How However, even after that first stock lead you got, that is exactly what is so fearful because you will constantly be reset and mm -hmm. frame trapped because of that platform. Yeah. 
And again, Tilted just holding on to the stage so well right now, just like waiting for Zaba to press too many buttons. But that time, Zaba spacing it a little bit better, a little bit more appropriately. Is that going to be the kill? Not quite yet. There we go, oh. the up smash out of shield. That time's going to do it. And that was just barely missed trade on that up smash before that would have taken the KO. Now, keep this up. There you go. Calls out the spot, but, uh, excuse me, the air dodge. What do you do afterwards? Nothing, because you got hit by your own gyro. Keeps the combo going wow. back here. Is he going to be able to find the follow-up KO? Calls out the oh. high recovery. Dara, oh my god, I, look. Okay, till day is nuts. Uh, but that time, getting a little bit too antsy with the down smash. I love the attempt, but Zamba was just in perfect space to be able to call that out. Great recovery angles. Zamba does not want to get hit by that, so you know what? He's just going to respect it. But God, back you. His butt is so big. <laughs> Rob, Rob's kind of thick. Hey, you know what? Looking like some mix a lot is Tilde, so hey, I guess it's making sense. <laughs> All I'm saying is this is the first time that I've ever realized that that back air got back. I mean, baby got back. I messed up the reference. Either way, Tilde uh. is getting destroyed. Covert over again. Calls out the jump, forces him to go high. What do you do about the recovery? Goes for the high recovery angle. Yeah, just not ready to be able to cover it in time. Tries to wait out that air dodge. Not going to be able to find it. I love the fact that he did an overextend, but now we got that awkward window where Tilde just needs a raw hit like an up smash to be able to kill but maybe outside of the kill confirm window. I mean speaking of up smash I think that's what Zamba is going to be hunting for. Zamba is going to be looking for that whiffed aerial on, on shield. We saw it before. Tried. I think Zamba was trying to set up for that position right there. Oh my. Gets the tech. <gasps> Luckily keeping himself alive. Tilde not committing quite yet. Just waits for Zamba to get overly aggressive just once. That was amazing. Jump backs and dash backs from Tilde but now finds himself in a nasty position. Why? <laughs> All right, look, oh. I, I was going to say, I'm not a betting man or anything, but I actually genuinely think Tilde is probably going to win this because even though, oh, oh my God, oh, and this buddy. is why. Look at this. He found one opening. Zamba has to find that grab or this up smash. There it is. There's that one whiffed aerial on shield. Finally finds the mistake. And Tilde was reading that roll in too. He was going for the downer, just missed it. I know, I know you felt good after you're like, oh, that's going to be an up smash and then a hit. That's a, that little gush of serotonin. That's the commentator's big brain coming into play. You did an amazing job, Ajax. You, I, 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 you know, usually I'd say like it was a nice hard read, but I was just flow charting at that point. Like, <laughs> we, Rob is always going to be so hungry for that round smash net. And it's always beautiful when they go yeah. ahead and seal the deal for us right on cue. And he, you see Yeah, it. he got it. He got it. But yeah, his timing was just a slightly off, actually, by frames. I love that you caught that because I didn't fully recognize that myself. But game moves. We have game six, two finals. Going to be going to Battlefield. Falco on Battlefield, oh buddy. Yeah, this is, a, it, but one thing that does at least work for Rob in this position is actually nothing, apparently. Uh, yeah. they, they just get, they just get, keep getting juggled wow. like nothing mattered. And so far, Tilde is on the longest extended zero to death we've seen all night. Wow. And again, that's that's just Falco on Thank Battlefield. Looking, looking like Google Chrome with all those extensions. That was the cleanest thing I've said all night, and it's going to stay that way. I mean, currently, you know, Zamba looked like Internet Explorer because he actually hasn't joined the game. He's currently hasn't hit him oh. once. That time was because it got hit by his own gyro. Full up tilts. Oh, oh my. my god, look. Falco on Battlefield, what can I say? Against Rob? This is, this is exactly what you would think of the matchup. Tilde forcing the high recovery. Has the great idea, but maybe just a little bit too low to find that down and, and catching all of those goals in, just as you mentioned. My friend, he is he is on something. Look, in the city that never sleeps, it looks like Zamba's going to bed before midnight. Like, this is just straight up a mauling from Tilde right now because Zamba can't touch the ground. He can't beat him in center stage. Uh, and Tilde is camping on the platforms properly. So he's preventing Zamba from pretty much going airborne safely. Like right there, he actually, he caught Nair on the platform instead of being yeah. able to get a shield pressure. But I feel like once again, all of Zamba's openings have been Tilde pressing side B in questionable spaces. But you can't get away with long gauge uh, lasers like that. You always have to remember that Falco has an excellent option there. Eldar just passed that, not in the percent window for it to follow up, gets that spot. Mike tries to go for a bit of a clever tech chase there. Love the down tilt because of how it was spaced nice and safe. I also like that forward air too because it covers many things. It covers potential spot dodge. It covers potential... Uh, <gasps> to, oh, and that forward air also oh kills. Oh my god. Down tilt currently up two stocks. We've seen what tilt they could do with the stock up before. Now with this, I... Oh, doesn't find the drag down. Actually gets the full final hit and, and sends Zomba to the corner. I do believe that was a bit of a misplay. Yeah, here we go. Now we're on a position once again, trying to, like, Zamba needs, like, just, ba this is basically living with a prayer. Oh, and you're upset. This game is broken. He misses the up smash, not going to find the KO, but does get the down smash. Yeah. 
People tend to miss text in those kinds of really high gushing situations, especially when they have a lead. I love the fact that Zamba went for it, would have covered, got up in place, and would have covered the tech goal in. So right now, Zamba doing a good job of starting to catch Tilde once again on all of these side Bs. Back onto the stage, pressuring him all the way out there, but pressing side B a little bit too soon. Zamba had that. That was his. It was gift wrapped to him. And that was almost the stock Zamba needed to, to get himself back in this game oh if he my. caught that. But that is no longer on the table because the game is over. Zamba definitely looking pretty upset about that, but Tilde looking amazing and getting this W here tonight. Is this the first, you know, that uh, Tilde has, has won post... Okay, so Tilde actually did win last week, two so you're correct. It was wins. two weeks ago yeah. Yeah. that Zamba won. Yeah, but Tilde with two consecutive wins in a row. Man, he has, he has been working so hard. He has, his results have really, really been shining. It's amazing to see him succeed like this. His understanding of Falco advantage is oh, delicious. Because yep. not only is his execution fantastic, which honestly is the most that you can ask for, but his knowledge and awareness to be able to move around stages like Town City, like Battlefield, to be able to squeeze out every single last hit. And then his also un own understanding of like, wait, I don't think this will fully link. I can mix here. Mm -hmm. I'm going to position myself. I'm going to wait. I'm going to reset the situation. So not only, once again, does he have a phenomenal combo game, but just a general amazing understanding of advantage overall because his spots where he waits and repositions, honestly, couldn't be better.